<laughs> Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Super Mario RPG here on Late Impressions. <sighs> oh boy, last episode was an official rage quit. I just stopped playing. I don't I still don't know how long the last episode was. I haven't edited it yet. But I just stopped playing and went with what footage I had because I was too angry to record anything else. I also said last episode that I would get a little bit farther and see what I could find out. But I haven't really gotten anywhere yet because I got to this point and I realized there's probably something up here that I'm going to miss out on if I just run right by it. So I decided to start recording. In between episodes, we got something. Toadstool is now level 13, and she learned a new ability, Come Back, Whoops. which revives one or more pals, which would be great if Toadstool was the last one remaining, with her health, not very likely, and that's assuming that I don't have any more of the pick-me-up items available. Those things are five coins apiece. I think this is kind of a pointless ability to use flowers on. I mean, it's good if there's if Peach is actually the last character left alive, but really, is Bowser ever going to be knocked out before Toadstool is? I don't think so. While I'm in here, I'm going to group hug because I got flowers to spare, and I guess now we're going to jump and hope that we don't run into any more bees. Oh no! Bad. This is bad. This is very bad. Keep away! There we go. Oh, we didn't make it. Well, it's a new enemy. Two new enemies. What the? All right. Uh. This is our first look at the mushroom status, and apparently Bowser has turned into a mushroom. Mario, quit drooling. You are not allowed to touch him. Oh! Bowser recovered health. I wonder if this is a thing that mushrooms do. Like, when you become a mushroom, you recover health? That'd be weird. But, okay, whatever. Well, the scene is dead now. Oh boy. Wait, Escrow Dust? Will that turn him into a Mushroom Scarecrow? Nope, he'll stay a Mushroom. Now, a Paratrooper Shell to the face. Turns Bowser out of the Mushroom status. And we get very little for our efforts. That's actually a very easy battle. I wouldn't mind fighting these guys. Whereas last episode we had those freaking geckos. Yeah, I'm still not happy about them. Welcome to the Sky Bridge! This big tourist attraction here, Yahoo! It doesn't look very safe. It's kinda... It's got holes in it. Wanna challenge it? I guess I got it if I wanna move forward. Okay, only five coins from you. Hey! Need an explanation? Sort of, yeah, and you're not the killer toad, so I'll trust you. You can cross the Sky Bridge in one of three ways! However, if you fall at any time, you'll lose. Oh joy, monies. Look at those gaps, they're all over the place. And you know, you guys know how bad I am at platforming, and this is a diagonal platforming, so... Terrific. On the normal course, you make it across just by jumping. Okay, that's the only one I could think of. I'll get five coins for that. On the special course, the blocks will fall if your time runs out. You'll get eight coins there. On the expert course, the blocks will fall and the jumps are harder. You'll get a frog coin there. Oh, now you're making it worth it. On all the courses, you'll have to jump and avoid the bullet guys. They're actually called Bill, and it would be nice of you to learn their first name since you are the proprietor of this game, but I guess that's asking too much, isn't it? Which course do you want? I'm bad at platforming, even the normal one. <laughs> Yahoo, good luck to you. Okay, thank you. I can do this. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Oh, that was 
rather simple, actually. You want to double your winnings? You can double the coins if you make it across the, on the same course in one attempt. The award in the course is harder, and if you fall, you won't get any coins. Still want to try? No. Here you go, as promised. A refund. All right. Got that done and over with. Thank goodness. Hello, mouse. Ah, haven't been here in a while. I've been busy traveling around. Where are you heading? Is it Monster Town by any chance? Sure, if <laughs> that's on the way. Okay, listen up. Listen for the whirl where the ant pops up and proceed after it. Oh, look for the whirl. I thought, <laughs> listen for the whirl. I can't hear a whirl. Look for the whirl where the ant pops up and proceed after it. Is this like an ant line thing? Keep following it and you'll find your way underground. Once there, Monster Town's just around the corner. I'll see you there. This sounds interesting. And just for safety's sake, I'm going to save. Alright, so, a whirl where an ant pops up. That's neither of you. Uh, I have actually seen that enemy getting back here. That is a Shogun. I don't know if it's an ant, so... Run around him. You're not an ant, right? I'm pretty sure you're not an ant. You don't look like an ant. Pardon me. There's something on the right. Oh, it's up here now. That's still the Shogun. Or is that what I have to do? Is that really an ant? Oh, here we go. There's gotta be a secret over here somewhere. Where's the secret? Where's the secret? Come on! They bring me all the way over here and there's not gonna be a secret? This really, really sucks. I am very disappointed in you, game. Alright, I guess I'll just... jump in there. Yeah, Shoguns! I don't think they're anything special. And rotating the control pad. I'm doing a horrible job at rotating the control pad. The game thinks I'm drunk. That's good enough, though. Ah, uh, they increase the vigor! Great. They increase the vigor! Great. Increases vigor, too! Great. I guess none of them got poisoned either, because they didn't lose any health during that round. Defense up! That's a good thing. Carney Kiss. Oh! Carney Kiss is the one that those uh, mini-boss boxes use on us. Very dangerous. That really was horrible. There we go. Now Princess Peach defeats the Shogun. Or not. Bowser defeats the Shogun with Mario. Princess Peach was completely useless. Probably. Is this one right? No, 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 no. This one, right? There we go. It was that one we were supposed to... Okay, there's another one. I guess he really is the ant. And we have to... Feed him every single time. Actually, can I run? Oh, I can't. I'm just gonna be the same battle and over, over and over, so okay. Well, that's interesting. They're gonna keep changing it on us? Come on. Come on. No. Oh, oh, no! Oh, boy. This is going to be most unenjoyable. What was that? Oh, what was- No! It was this one, wasn't it? Yeah. Pretty sure. No, it wasn't. Terrific. Alright, before I get too far into this... Here's what we're gonna do. Peach, heal everybody. Thank you. Now we're going to switch out Peach for Mallow. And resume the battles. Come on. 
but but I I thought I saw a coin did I jump on the ant and then fight the bees okay Well, that guy's immune to thunder. But, it's a simple battle, so I'll take it. Uh... There it worked. Alright, now I jump on you again. go. How am I supposed to figure out which one to... Okay, this is getting weird, dude. There we go. Oh, level up for Mario. Didn't we have this last episode? With all the guys that we... Hello! Ultra Jump! There's gonna be something stronger than the Super Jump. That's interesting. For Mario, we will upgrade his... Hmm. Hit points. That'll be better than the long one. Even though that only went up by three, that's not very good. Malorn's Snowy, was that? Mallow gets his magic attack going up by two, while Mario only gets his hit points going up by three, when I've seen eight before. It was this one, I am sure. Yeah, this is new. I'm actually gonna walk around a little bit. Climb here. Oh, hello again. Isn't this incredible? It really does look like the edge of the world, doesn't it? It's too spooky for me. I'm heading back to Monster Town. See ya! Wait, what? I thought this was our goal. Well, Mario is a master platformer, unlike me. So I think we can make it up. But I think we can make it up. Never mind. You're not a sign I can read, so. Okay! Gotcha. That was freaking amazing. That took a lot of flower points, and it was worth it. But that was freaking amazing. Bowser, more magic to you. Now it goes up by three. Terrific. Come back here. Come back here. Thank you. I think I should save. Alright, what's our status here? Everybody is surprisingly at full health. Our flowers are getting kind of low, though. Hmm. We can keep going. We can keep going. Oh, not these guys again. Die! Please die. All of you die. Die forever and eternally. Didn't make it to the last ones, but that's okay. Toadstool is level 14. That means since the last episode, she's gone up by two levels. That's... Wow. All right, uh, what I did last episode is I boosted her magic attack. Yeah, uh, funny thing about that. I've been thinking that uh, Toadstool's healing abilities have a magic power, if you haven't noticed. And I believe that she will be able to heal more if her magic attack is higher. So, I think that we should start upgrading her magic attack, since her hit, her hit points are not going up. At all. And we just boosted her magic attack by three. Freaking... Everybody except Mario, for crying out loud. Anyway... I think that if we keep on boosting her magic attack, 
we'll see actual good continuous results, whereas us boosting our hit points, it's really not getting us anywhere. So we'll start boosting up her magic abilities now. Also, Gino levels up, that's cool. And for Gino, dip 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 Gino Blast. That sounds cool, we'll have to switch him out for a while. And I'm gonna boost his magic attack just so we can see what it does. Actually, these guys are pretty weak. Let's switch out Mallow for Gino. And take one out. Alright, Gino Blast affects everybody. Holden Y. Holy Disco Lights! Gino, I love you. That was impressive. Sweet bloody mercy, that was impressive. Let me, uh... Look at this here. It uses 12 flower points. Beam hits all foes. Energize! And that wasn't even his last technique. He's going to another one at level 17. That was incredible. That was absolutely incredible. My word. Um... Let's use him in this battle, too. Sadly, I could not use Geno's special ability on that one because we were all out of flowers. So... Let's cheat. There we go, now we have 54 flowers available to us. Oh, oh, oh. Where's our... Oh. Ooh. Uh, run away. Who's back there? You're looking for a star? I'll sell you one for 400 coins. Are you interested? No. So yourself, see ya. Oh, wait. Oh. I actually wanted to say no just to see how many coins I had. I have plenty of coins. That would have been amazing. Holy cow, that would have been amazing. Can I reset this? Just kinda... No, I can't. Oh, <laughs> we, really, we really missed out. Okay, okay. Just kinda sneak around. Balaam Temple. Oh boy, Balaam. I remember Balaam. Hi there. For 100 coins, this shortcut will get you back to the surface. No. Is it... Oh. Yeah, it's a little worrisome. Keep going. Coin, 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 coin. Oh. That sort of looks like Balaam, and it sort of looks like a dog. Who are you? Do you want your fortune told? It'll cost 50 coins. Nah. I'm okay. No spoiler games. No spoilers from the game. Oh. They're gonna make us do it anyway. Alright, fine. 50 coins. What do you have to sell us? See the three faces on the wall? Hit them in any order and da 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 No, I was actually going for the one on the left first, but... If you proceed through the pipe next door, you'll have many friends in the future. Oh, are we gonna get another party member? Who are you? Oh, you're an enemy. Formless? This is a uh, boss theme, actually, so... Why don't we give Bowser a Genio Boost? Um, actually, Terrorize might be a good thing to start. I'm rotating, I'm rotating, uh, I'm rotating the runway. Mokuka. Duh. <laughs> What the heck are you? Okay, Gino Whirl, please. Only 18? I know it can do more than that. And it was actually kind of weak, too. I want to see the Gino Whirl at full power. I want to see the Gino Whirl at full power. For now, toss Mario. And Mario kicks. Yeah, you gotta be stronger than that.
Yeah, it's not gonna get any stronger. That was pretty darn strong. Uh huh. Um, 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 um. Can you do this? This looks ridiculous. This looks absolutely stupid too. But it will know if it worked in a second. Actually, I have an ultra jump now. I'll try that. Really? I actually took all the time to bounce on him 17 times and I did no damage. Gino, boost Mario's power infinitely. Whoa! Alright, there's a uh, critical timing moment in that too, where we can boost the defense as well as the attack. Cool! Alright, uh. Bowser! Attack him! That did 141 damage, now Mario will do... 136, and take him out! Okay! That's the end of that! No coins! But we got 30 experience, so whatever. That was weird. That was a weird battle. Totally came out of nowhere. Yeah, I don't want to fight you guys. Don't want to fight you guys! I have to fight you guys, don't I? <sighs> Give me a minute. Actually, give me more than a minute because they have to uh, <laughs> switch somebody out for don't stool. You're the option. I need health. I can't get much health. Okay, Mario, you're it. And I guess we're going to switch out Toadstool for Gino because these two on the right can only use magic attacks, and we're kind of short on flowers. I could use an item to heal Gino, but whatever. Yay for Mario! Is that the second level up we've gotten in this episode? Crazy. For Mario, it will be the... We haven't upgraded his power in a while, actually. And it went up by two! Hey, hey, hey! Lucky, lucky! Now it's at level 15, I don't care about his stats, I just care about his magic attack, and it goes up, and now I'm gonna fight the last one of the group. Another level up for Bowser at level 15. By the way, Bowser is now the first character to break 200 damage. That was incredible. Bowser learns Crusher. That sounds like a Bowser move. For you, more magic. Just because. And the door opens. Here comes the water. No water. I'm fine with this. More coins, I'm fine with this too. Where's the, uh... I have a bad feeling about this. Oh, frog coin, okay. <sighs> now what do you want? The yellow tile will get you to the next room. Your fortune determines which room you'll arrive at. If you're lucky, you'll run into Balaam, and Monster Town will be just behind them. If you're lucky, you'll run into Balaam. Right, can I... Thank you. Mmm, I'm so hungry. Wish I had something to eat. Yeah, that sounded like him. Oh uh, boy. Yellow tile. Gonna lead us to a boss battle against Balaam again. Terrific. And no. I'm done with this episode. I'm gonna have a lot of battles to edit out in this one, too. So many level ups, too. By the way, who's next to level up? Oh, Gino. Definitely Gino. And Princess Peach. <coughs> Princess Toadstool. Right after him. So. Thank you for joining me for this episode of Super Mario RPG. If you like this episode, click the like button because that's what YouTube made it for. Come back next episode when we will level up Gino and possibly be fighting Balaam again. I wonder if he's a ghost, and if he is a ghost, can I defeat him with a pure water? That would be interesting to find out. I think I'll actually try it, because I haven't really wanted to use the pure water on anything else. Not since the pirate ship, anyway. Come back then, and we will hopefully arrive in Monstro, Monstro Town right after that. See you then!